Hey y'all, hey. Welcome back to another YouTube video. And today we are doing small knotless, medium small knotless on myself. Here's the hair. I'm doing 316 and color 4 together. I'll pull up the inspo pick of what I want to do. I feel like the color's okay. Um, maybe her blonde was more of a honey, if that makes sense. But this is what I got. I think I like it. We're working on freshly. Okay, y'all, I'm a little bald on the edges. And I've been using my TG Daily Moisture for that. And my TJ Repair. I'm definitely a TJ girl right now. I use the shampoo and conditioner and the hair mask. And my hair feels so soft. I did a, like, a light blow dry and I, uh, oh my gosh, my earring. And then I used this heat protectant for my hair. And then if it was a little matted, which it wasn't, because I deep conditioned it, so it was pretty cool to go through my hair, I would detangle it with um, Cantu Shea Butter Coil Calm Detangler. This is what I would use. And yeah, and this is just my blow dryer from the regular beauty supply store. But yeah, y'all can you can literally pull your fingers all the way through my head. And yeah, so I'm about to get started. It's pretty late. I do have a client tomorrow. So I set up for my client, but I kind of want to get started on a braid or two myself. Because I have cosmetology school, um, so I have two days off. So I have two days to do my hair and do a client's hair. So yeah, let's try to get my hair done within a two day span. I hope you like this video and find it useful. And while you're still here, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe to the YouTube channel, guys. All hair and beauty content will be coming to you soon. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Miana Style on all platforms. A lie. So I big chopped my hair. A little backstory. I big chopped my hair. Last year, Jan or July, July 5th, I had locks. I cut it all off. I shaved all my sides all down. I'll put a picture. Shaved everything down, kept the front. And it hasn't even been a month yet. And, like, I've always dealt with, like, really just damaged hair, y'all. Choppy hair. But this is probably the healthiest my hair has been because I've just been moisturizing it, protective styles, and, and actually washing my hair. I feel like black girls, and let me speak for myself. I was taught really like not to wash my hair often. So if I had braids in, I wouldn't wash my hair with the braids in. That is insane. What? Like, you should be able to wash your hair with braids, which you should. I just wasn't taught that. You know, I thought I was messing it up. No, after at least three, four weeks, if your hair if, like, if you feel like it needs cleaned, wash it. Um, I had cornrows in before this, and I washed my cornrows. But y'all, I'm just geeked because, like, it's not no big ponytail, but. <sighs> Excuse me. I thought, you know, like, my hair can fit. Whatever, but it just feels really good. And my goal is to have, like, a really, really big, natural, fro, healthy fro. I feel like I, when I grow up, I didn't see a lot of black girls with that. And I want to be able, I want to embrace my hair and love my hair, which I do. And I'm happy I'm this far. Y'all, it's the edges for me. I need some kind, some kind of cream. If y'all know oil, let me know. Like, I got it. You know what I'm saying? But it's just, like. It's a little gappy. It could be a lot fuller. And I don't know if that comes with just a lot of edge control. I don't know. But, yeah. Let's just get started. It's about to be 12 o'clock. And I, my client comes at 8 a.m. So, I'm probably just going to middle part it. And maybe just start the front a few bit. Um, I think I'm going to do butt length. Butt or, butt or, like, lower butt, like, under cheek length. I think so. But stay tuned. I'm so glad you chose to watch this video, guys. I hope it's entertaining and I hope you just learned something. Yeah. Okay, guys. Hey. Clearly, I only have three braids done, but. I've decided we're not doing this because I want grip. And yes, my parts are okay. But I just really want... Sorry, I just got to eat in dinner. But I would really prefer for someone to really, like, grip my hair. So if I have to pay to get it done, I would. 
and I just I need something else so I'm gonna have either my mom or maybe me try to braid my hair up in some cornrows and do a drawstring type of thing I just want to show y'all how convenient my braid bands are so I'm about to go run to the hair store to go get me my um drawstring ponytail or say for you if you know you had a date in a few weeks but you're waiting to get your hair done you could purchase you a braid band and it will hold you over in my case i can't wear it to school because i can't wear like scarves or hats but to the hair store it works my braid bands also come with a wig cap so you wouldn't have to provide one it comes with one um and if you have more hair than me then you would just braid your hair down two to four maybe eight braids depending on how thick your hair is put your wig cap on so we can keep everything nice and tidy i got a clip in here it's okay snap your braid band on just like that snap it on you know what i'm gonna do water for y'all Just some water does it, literally. And watch, I get people, who did your hair? And I'm gonna tell them, y'all, it's a wig, I sell these. <laughs> oh, 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 come on, girl. Can't even tie a scarf. I think because I'm rushing, so it's not going as fast. But see how, like, I can see the little, the stuff? Your hair needs to be braided down. But it still does what it needs to do for my quick hair store run. Instead of wearing a bonnet, you know what I'm saying? This gives a cleaner look. Ladies, we want to look presentable. Okay. Look at that. Ah, braids. if you can still tell i think because i know you can tell but you can't tell can you y'all this is my bra length one bra length your siblings will tell you the truth myla 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 yeah. is my hair look okay yeah it is it looks like my hair is braided yeah it looks fine we're good to go All right, y'all, we're changing up the whole style. I think I'm about to do butterfly locks or just fox locks on myself. Just something easy and simple that I know I can achieve and it will look good even when it's old. I think that's my best bet. I'm gonna get the 32 inch instead of the 40 inch. It's way too long. Yeah, I mean, I was in here for a minute just contemplating on what to get. I was gonna get the drawstring, but I'm like, it's a hit or miss. And I know with the fox locks, that I'll probably just that would just probably be the best bet for my hair to grow too. So we're just gonna get a few packs of those. They don't have one B, or they have three one B, but I need more. So I'm just gonna do color black. Guys, so I got five packs of the lock hair and I got four packs of the wrap up hair that I'm holding in the video. And that was more than enough for my hair. I had leftover wrapping hair but then i went ahead and pre-parted my hair and then i ended up having my sister come down and do the back for me because i'm not doing all that work she can help me out and it did wonders but you can also do it yourself if you have no help but once we got both sides completed with braids then i went ahead and started wrapping it just so it would help on time because i knew it would take a while if i waited her to finish the back so i just went ahead and started wrapping the front but locks are a really quick and keeping it style. Like if you want to do your own hair, this is very easy, y'all. Very simple. It's not hard at all. I think anyone can get it with just some practice. Hiya. Hi, guys. Testing, testing. Basically, this is what we have done so far. Devana, my sister, has pre-parted the back for me. She has two more rows done. She has two more rows or two more braids to do. And then she's done and she's going to bed. Thank you so much, Devana, for doing what you can. That's good. 
let's go. <laughs> and she and I have been putting, well, I did this one myself, and then I've been putting the locks in. That's pretty easy. It's almost 12 o'clock, so I'm thinking to stay and just finish this, finish it up tonight. Why drag this on? It don't take long, guys. So, yeah, let's we're on a roll to our big, big fro that we want. If I thought my hair was able to be in these little braids, are amazing. They're so cute. And I'll upload a picture. My hair can fit in a freaking ponytail. Don't play with me. I'm not one of them. Okay? <laughs> Ponies. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I don't know. It's funny. My it's hair fits in a ponytail. Go outside with it. Go. <laughs> <laughs> 12 on the dot y'all i mean 12 on the dot my sister went upstairs and i don't blame her i appreciate the help and it's time to get to business y'all so i started wrapping these braids up and keep watching because at the end towards the end of this i will be showing you detail on how i wrapped it but i just want to kind of get through this and not to not to talk about my sister but you're gonna see how clean my parts are on the front and then how her parts aren't the best but they're not that bad but you can kind of just see um the difference which i don't really care as long as I can put some locks on it. I'm all good. Yeah, you can see right here. It's a really good video or pick, just an image of how they're not the best. The sizing is all over, but it really don't matter because it's all going to look good. It's all going to come together. Um, and these are like a medium type of look. And in the front, maybe more medium. Um, but yeah, this is just me going over it, but not detailed yet. And I think this is like 2 o'clock right here. Yeah, it's 2 o'clock because I had two more left and I want to show y'all in detail how I did it. I had to open up my last pack just for two little ones. That's the worst thing, but it is what it is. I bought that many just so I can have enough, y'all. And this made me realize how much I really do mess with locks because they're just so quick and convenient. I got done with this in like three, four hours. Okay, but for the detailed demonstration, y'all, I used the wrap-up hair and I crochet it through my plait braid. Okay, you see? Boom, boom, boom. Then I grab my lock and I crochet my lock onto my actual braid, not through the scalp. Okay, you see that's my little fro hair poking out. I grab that and pull the lock close to my scalp. Grabbing the twist hair and my lock and my braid in one hand with just the wrapping hair in another hand and I start to wrap. That's literally all it is. Oh, and also I would like kind of add some force and push up with the hand that's holding everything so i can make sure i'm wrapping it and you're not just wrapping your hair you want to make sure you're wrapping the lock and everything you know you want to have you see you want to have a grip make sure you're applying a little bit of force and holding it up it's hard to see but hopefully it kind of makes sense you want to make sure you're wrapping the you're wrapping the lock and then you just continue to wrap all the way down once you kind of have the lock wrapped it's easier you don't have to have that much force but in the beginning hand in the beginning part you really got to kind of hold it up there um, so you make sure you catch it and there you go and the smaller your boxes are or depending on the density of your hair It's easier um, to wrap it and like, you don't see your hair poking out of it and y'all that's it real simple real easy I want to repeat it crochet it through the scalp pull it through then I add my lock onto my braid holding the wrapping hair and the lock in one hand and the other hand the hair and wrapping it see how that kind of got knotted I'm still going to use it to wrap because, you know, it's a, it's a distressed, fluffy look. So it doesn't need to be, you know, perfect. These type of locks came with curls on the end. And that's okay because I plan on cutting them anyway. Because I love the distressed look of these locks. So I just went ahead and snipped off the curls. I wasn't going for that type of look. Um, and some did unravel. But I think it's just how you cut it. I was kind of careless when I cut it. So just cutting it and making sure you're not getting into the lock. So guys, I it's like two thirty. What time is it? It's two thirty four. It's time for bed. I'm just gonna put my scarf on, and I'll probably wake up early in the morning to like wet it, put some mousse on it, you know, do my finish touches. But I just wanted to kind of get it, not kind of. I wanted to get it installed. And to my liking, I do have somewhere to go in the morning. Oh, is that a curl? No. But yeah, we're good. These should last me about a month and a half, maybe two months. I'm pushed too much because people, you know how I was saying earlier, people uh, 
do touch-ups with locks and wash your hair locks so this is something that i think my hair will definitely grow in because my hair is in plaits regular braids i'm just wrapping on it so i think this will be good for my hair and locks look good when they're really old it gives that natural look and i look good in these locks so and it's gonna be nice for school so i don't gotta do my hair but good night y'all i'm tired y'all have a beautiful night and i hope god washes over you and he removes any temptations out of your life and he helps you to he i hope that he delivers you from evil and i hope that he gives you discernment and i pray that you can that you can just find him because he'll lead you and he'll guide you. Sorry if that kind of felt a little like spacey. I was just trying to figure out what I wanted to say. You know? Be real swept of my words. Y'all, so this is like maybe a week after having the longer uh, distress locks. And I love, love, love it. Got so many compliments. But it is 9 to 5 degrees outside. Okay, it's hot. So I had to go ahead and get the scissors and cut and cut and cut. But the thing is, I look good in pretty much a lot of all, every style for a fro. Not even, not even gonna lie. So, so go ahead and give me a little bob. It's gonna relieve me of just having to deal with all this hair. It's thick, but it is real cute. And in the winter, this lock style is so convenient. I'm not gonna lie. It keeps you warm, cute. Who don't like a long bust down? Come on now. That's what it gives. But with this school moving around, clients, I need something short and protective and this is what it gave me so cute it looks a little more natural too y'all and after the, and during this period i did decide to go no s control um just so i could see the difference in my edges and not do too much so yeah that is it guys i hope you like this video subscribe to my channel for more beauty content y'all and i hope you learn something for real have a good day